Mm-hmm. You mentioned flow when Belichick had his um he you know he screwed up his text messages. I were, were con- you know he black Brian white Brian. He didn't Got know to. which one he was texting. Were you called for a character witness because he once did screw up you and your brother, right? <laughs> He did mess that up, didn't he, before a Super Bowl? Yeah, he uh, early on when we got there, like he didn't know who was I, – I was just called Devin most of the time. I think he was just used to saying that name. So it was just like, Devin, what are you doing? It was just like, no, nah, I'm, I'm Jason, coach. Uh, but, no, nah, I, I didn't I didn't get called in. I think that's a that's a simple fix. Like like you just said, you go into contacts, you just make a little edit to the names, and that, that simplifies it. Did, did he do – he when you weren't on the Patriots, he screwed it up, right? He did. Um, that was – um, Dev's second year, they make it to the Super Bowl in Indianapolis, and they're playing the Giants. And we're down there, and I know too well the the family schedule when you go down to the Super Bowl. I tell other people, I won one, went to that Super Bowl I played in, but I've been to five of them because I went to four of them as as the brother of Devin McCourty. But we're there Saturday before the Sunday game, and that's when you do the whole family pictures, and everybody's down on the field. So I'm down there. I think I'm dressing like jeans and a hoodie or something. And Bill walks up to me. He's like, "What the hell are you doing? Like, you got to get." Dress, we're doing the team, pick. and he doesn't finish the sentence. He's like, "Oh hell, you're Jason." Had no idea, like Perfect. just just blew it. And I was just like, "Yo, if you want me to go put a uniform, like I'll, I'll line up for yes. you guys. Whatever y'all need, I'll run down on kickoff." But have yeah, you ever, definitely. Have you ever thought about doing something like that? Like going back to high school, one of you guys sprains an ankle, the other like puts on the uniform real quick, steps in. I remember our, my uh, my second year, Dev's rookie year. Jeff Fisher comes up to me we're in practice, and he was just like. You and your brother look qu- quite alike, huh? He was just like, I bet if he walked in here and you left, like, we wouldn't know. I was like, no one would have any idea. <laughs> uh, this would be the year to do it. Like, yeah. I'm out the league. Like, I fly up to Foxborough, put the stuff on. I know the defense. Like, yep. I know where I'm walking in the building. This would be the time for me to kind of go up there and, and, and get some stuff done. You should. I'm, like, I'm not trying to tell you how to do your job, but that would be an electric good morning football segment. That would. You just yeah. try to live a day. And see if anyone notices. Just walk into the building and, yeah. and, and see. Like yeah. I, I would just need one person in New England to be okay with it because somebody has to tell Dev to stay home so right. he doesn't get fined. Right. Um. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that, that would. Like, okay. okay. That's, that's the way, a video. That's the way that yeah. you do it. If if you know, God forbid, he he like breaks a finger or something like that, and needs a couple of weeks off. Yeah. You just put the pads on. You split the check with him. That's that. And, that would be the tough negotiation. He'd have to give up some of that money. Yeah. So. How much? How much would you? Would it cost for you to step in? Like, would you need those full two weeks? Of pay for his contract if you stepped in and played two games for him without anybody knowing yeah you said split we know I, I if i'm playing i'm going to meetings i need that full two and he's he's still getting paid a lot so he's getting paid a lot more than me so we, yeah. we're gonna just, need that just so you know if he does like twist an ankle or something like that he's and he's out for a week i'm and when he comes back i'm just gonna say that it's you yeah I'm gonna spread that rumor <laughs> yes out there. Oh, and, wait and, to uh, see how he plays first though yeah like, yeah, yeah, if yeah he's out there stinking it up don't don't put that on me like <laughs> let, let him take that another media tip for you um just anytime a quarterback does something great just be like if patrick mahomes did this everybody would go nuts that's just a good thing to say like yeah. people love that shit so yeah. anytime a quarterback does like a little sidearm pass and I people brought my notebook like matt stafford he does that a lot and people do go nuts <laughs> when matt stafford does it but it's it's more impactful if you tell people like hey you'd be freaking out if mahomes did this but <laughs> yeah. you're not doing it right now. yeah that's perfect right i there. love that i yeah. love that yeah mahomes is the houdini